My name is Beverly and I love to draw cats. I'm a professional artist and working from photographs, I've drawn cats from all over the world. I create portraits in colored pencil and then share the story of each cat and the art process here on video. <laughs> Today I'm drawing Tim Tam, a ginger tabby who lived in Perth, Australia with her humans Alan and Sue. Over her long life, she was loved by three generations of their family. She originally wandered into the home of the grandmother, who let her two-year-old granddaughter pick the cat's new name. The toddler chose the name Tim Tam after a popular chocolate biscuit made in Australia. When the grandmother passed away in 2008, Tim Tam's future was uncertain. The family couldn't bear the thought of Tim Tam being put down, so they brought her home to live there. It was the best thing that ever happened to them. Tim Tam was not a lap kitty, but she liked to keep close to her humans at all times. At night, she slept next to them. During the day, she would sit on the coffee table in the family room or hang out on the floor all day while Alan worked in his home office. She was shy and would hide when company came over, but the rest of the time she was present for whatever her family was doing. She took her role as the protector of the household seriously and held all the mice at bay. She didn't pay much attention to birds and in fact sat with Alan when he fed their tame magpie Morgan. In her golden years, Tim Tam enjoyed such earthly pleasures as napping all day, wandering around in the garden, or helping herself to other people's glasses of water. When Tim Tam crossed the Rainbow Bridge in 2018, just shy of her 23rd birthday, She'd been part of the family for nearly the entire life of the little girl who had named her. The family misses her terribly and will always remember their beloved Tim Tam, who came out of nowhere and taught them that love can arrive when you least expect it. Here's the finished portrait. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to learn more about getting a portrait done for your cat or as a gift for someone else, visit my website, ilovetodrawcats.com.